Bridgie Productions, we're going to be installing the Ward Axon 4500 winch on a Polaris Dynamics Turbo. Um, this kit is supposed to include everything. You got some mounting plates right here. The actual winch itself. Looks like the fair lead, the hook, some simple wiring. Of course, your positive, negative. There's a remote for it, uh, the switch. And then uh, so far, all I've had to do on the dynamics was remove the grill, remove down here, this little plastic cover, which is right there. And then, uh, so now I'm gonna look at the instructions and figure out what we have to do. Okay, so the next thing I did here is I installed the fair lead onto this outer bracket going to go right right here but because of some modifications of mine I got to wait uh, a little bit later before I install it um, as you can tell I went ahead and took off the entire base plate of the dynamics um, the next thing I went ahead and did is remove the differential tube here and just set it aside and then you can see right here is the winch mounting plate and on a dynamics it's a little hard to install because of all these all these uh, radiator tubes but you come in through the a arms right here and angle up and then just set it in there and it'll uh, eventually sit right there so next I'm going to install the bolts and get that firmly in place and then I'll be installing the winch. Okay, this was not fun, but next you'll, after you get that plate mounted, I uh, recommend putting the positive negative wires on before you install the winch. Also pull the fair lead rope through before um, it's in mounting the winch because it's really hard to get your hands back there. As you can see in the, the dynamics here, there's tubes everywhere the turbo causes all those uh, radiator tubes and so it's a tight squeeze um, next you'll uh, mount the winch to the plate with the four provided bolts from Warren um, now I'll start the wiring all right and the last part with the Warren axon winch so you can see right here I just kind of it splits off like that, so I kept the remote on this side and I just drilled a hole through the firewall and then I'm gonna take this and I'll hook it up here in a bit. Then I just got the switch, or the, all it is is a plug-in and it'll plug right into the actual button right there. So real easy, but I gotta figure out which way is up and down. And then I, uh, I, just, I drilled in the actual remote piece right here. I figured that would be a good location for that. And then I'm just gonna do my positive and negative coming off here. Run up the frame there. Connect the positive and negative right on here. And we should have an active winch. So like I said, the Axon winch is a lot easier to install than previous winches, but uh, Hopefully this video helps and that's all.